Welcome back to Mod Movie Mondays. I'm Claire. I'm Steph. I'm DJ. And I'm Lee. And today we are going to be watching The Whale with Brendan Fraser. I'm so excited. I am. Oh, I have been <laughs> waiting for this movie. You have no idea. This Brendan Fraser is my guy. <laughs> like, he is an amazing actor. I've been waiting for his comeback. Like, the standing ovation that he got. This guy got an eight-minute standing ovation for this role. Yeah. yeah. I'm so excited, yeah. just simply for Brendan Fraser. But I've also heard so many good things about this movie. Yeah, it looks really good. Mm -hmm. uh, DJ, have you heard anything about this movie? No, not really. <laughs> like I said, I live under a rock. <laughs> <laughs> Well, just to give you some context, um, we are filming this one week before the Oscars, oh, and yeah. he's nominated for an Oscar for this. For best he's actor. nominated for Best Actor. This, this man's work of, just body of work, is just crazy. And not the George of the Jungles of it all or anything hey, like that. Hey, George of the don't... Jungle is amazing. I love that movie. <laughs> yeah. That is an amazing <laughs> movie. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, if you go watch his other serious stuff, it's just it's he's this guy's amazing. He's an amazing so, actor and I'm so glad that he's back doing movies now. Yeah, me too. Because everybody loves him so much and he deserves all that love, especially after everything he has been through. He is just mm -hmm. a happy, bubbly, amazing man. And he deserves yeah. so much. All of this amazing credit and praise, he deserves every single inch of it. And I'm so happy for him. Yeah. yeah. So I hope he wins next week. So, <laughs> yeah. And then, like I said, DJ, when they showed this at the film festival, he got an eight minute standing ovation. Like, that's much crazy. Deserved. So I'm hoping I, I've got big, big expectations for this movie, but I don't have any fears that it will live up to this so without further ado you guys you want to get into it yeah. yes let's do it let's go let's get into it okay i know the only one with his these rules camera. can feel constraining oh. but remember the okay. point of this chord um. <laughs> this is... oh, God. okay um. oh. 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 That is a really bad time for that to be happening. Gosh, <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> are you okay? Should I call an ambulance? I should call an ambulance. Read this to me. Do you have a phone? My phone's dead. I need to. Please just read it. Okay. Okay. In the amazing book Moby Dick by the author Herman Melville, the author recounts the story of being at sea. In the first part of his book, the author calling himself Ishmael is in a small seaside town and he's sharing a bed with a man named Kick Kick. So what is this? Why am I reading this? Just the baddest of all when I read the boring chapters that were only descriptions of whales. Because I knew that the author yeah, was just I trying just... to save us from his own sad story. I don't know what's saying just anything. I just don't know what to say. This book made say. me think about yeah. my own life. And then it yeah. made me feel it's glad. It's such a weird opening. Oh, Did that really? help? Very intense. Look. So... Who is that and how did he have a key? Right. Sure you okay? Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Um, I'm sorry, I'm who are you? Are you acquainted with the gospel of Jesus Christ? What? I'm sharing Christ's uh, message Is he a Jehovah Witness? Oh, yeah. Like, I should call yeah. my friend, she's a nurse. <laughs> he just watched gay porn. Take care of me. Yeah, yeah. Okay, sorry. <laughs> Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Being in debt is better than being dead. Yeah. What's wrong with you? Why is there? Oh, a he's still there. It. Good thing too. If I Why had, you might have. Why is he still there? Okay, okay. I just hate the thought of you being so weird. If I was, and then he's like here. a teenager too. Yeah. Like, that'd be the most awkward shit ever. Absolutely. Uh -huh. What was my blood pressure? <gasps> Two thirty-eight. Holy oh, good shit! God. Mm. How is he not dead? Was. That's what mine was when I was in. <laughs> Eclamp like when I was having the eclampsia. Wow. That's really oh. bad. I haven't been to the bathroom all day. I'm that's seizure level. Like that's so bad. Why are you there? 
but believe me, he doesn't want to hear about new life. Why? Uh, because it's caused him a lot of pain. Oh. Why are you asking so many questions in a house that is not yours? Killed his boyfriend. That you were not invited into. Well, I mean, he kind of was. She killed his boyfriend? You're saying the church. <sighs> killed Charlie's boyfriend, yes. And I should add that new life has caused me a lot of pain in my okay. life, so... I'm sorry, that took to a hell of a lot to that. Yeah. Not now. Because he probably won't be here next week. Where is he going? Yeah. I'm sorry you had to come over, Liz. No, she it's okay. He's gonna die in the next sorry, I think, you know, so. I think that's what she meant, yeah. Charlie, your blood pressure is 238 I over I mean, his blood pressure is how high? Go to the hospital. Sorry. Stop saying you're sorry. Uh, no. I'm sorry. You say you're sorry one more time, I will shove a knife right into you, I swear to God! Go ahead, what's it gonna do? My internal organs are two feet in at least. <laughs> wow. <laughs> <laughs> Please. No. As somebody that struggled with weight and has just recently started losing it all, how much you beat yourself up for you. every single bite that you take. Yeah. It's just, but then at the same time, as you're beating yourself up, that's what you go for. Mm -hmm. In a small I think, um, I can't remember which movie said it. You were right about that being his boyfriend's. That really yeah, right. absolutely. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. A bit. Because he's got it memorized. And he keeps it on him, and, and you can tell the it's oldish because the yeah. baby's very dated. Oh. 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 He's just a poor big animal. I feel like there's a lot of bad boys yeah. he's pulling for himself. I feel bad for him. We have as well. Yeah. Oh my god, are we doing the final week of his life? Probably. I can't. Mm. Yeah. yeah, that's one way to get me and uh, Lee crying. Mm -hmm. We'll see if I cry. I don't know. I don't tend to cry too much with this type of stuff. Yeah. Like, I guess sad. I thought I'm you were going to end that sentence sad. I was like, uh, <laughs> Doreena, do we need to go look back at the last few reactions? <laughs> <laughs> no. Like, I will get sad. But, like, if I'm expecting a death to happen... Yeah. It's different. Like, I will get sad. Bridge I'm not a heartless bitch. <coughs> Bridge to Darabithia. Bridge to Darabithia is always going to be sad. Okay? I'm going to use everything against you. That's alright, DJ. I said the same thing. I can... Yeah, she's, she's crying. People are going to be like, I don't cry a lot. I've cried in, like, every fucking movie. Yep. Uh, don't go to Dr. Google. Right? Dr. Google <laughs> is the worst thing. Mm -hmm. I say it as I do yeah, that myself. <laughs> we oh all... yeah, when I got my official diagnosis for celiacs, I immediately was like, what the fuck mm. is that? It's very much seeming that binge eating for him or eating is a comfort yeah. for his mm -hmm. anxiety and depression. Which I fully understand is a coping mechanism. It's not a good one, but yeah, like oh, you can that. see, Damn. he doesn't want to be like this. Yeah, but I feel like he doesn't see any other way at this moment. He doesn't know. Yeah, another way. Hmm. Yeah. See, and now he's, he's disgusted. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh. Brendan Fraser is an amazing facial actor. Yeah. Like, mm -hmm. he hasn't said anything. And I want to cry. Yeah. Just by his face. And you can see all of these different emotions. You can. You really can. Oh. Are you going to go? Or are you going to call your friend? Come on. I hate it.
that noise. DJ and the noise. <laughs> It's like, it's certain frequencies too, because I can't hear low pitch because of the scar tissue. Mm -hmm. But if it is a high enough frequency and it has like a not texture get to it, no. I love Sadie Sink. I forgot Sadie Sink was in this movie. No, She's amazing. I love Sadie Sink so been. much. I just, I let it get out of control. Is this his daughter? Unexpected. Didn't expect him to have a kid. No. Well, I mean, it's really good to see you. Kind of makes sense. You look beautiful. Because a lot of times people don't realize they're either like bi or gay until cool. after. Yeah. You're a senior. Depending right. on how they grew yeah, up. Yeah. Yeah. Last time you saw me. No, I'm not talking about what you look like. Yeah. You'd be disgusting even if you weren't this fat. Ouch. Wow. You'd still be that piece of shit dad who walked out on me when I was eight. All because he wanted to fuck one of his students. Can I have one of these? I'm sorry. What? Uh. Oh. I mean, I kind of get her. Anger in oh, some absolutely. way. It's been a long time. I've I been there. Maybe Not like with this situation, get to know but each I've other. had that kind of hate towards oh, my here. Yeah. yeah. I can pay you. Wow. Yes. Mm. Just don't tell your mom. She's gonna right? regret the way she's yeah, acting right absolutely. And she is, but do some writing just it for is me. still valid in Why? that way, if that makes sense. Yes. Yeah, because you're a smart she's person. Like it is. Like, I mean, not the way that she's treating him writer. in certain aspects, no. but the anger towards the him anger. is really valid. It's, it's 100% valid, but it's one of those where I'm sure mom you. went to get in her head. Yeah. And then the anger festered. Stand up and walk over to me. What? She's Come over here. Two and walk two toward together. me. Mm -hmm. The fact that he's willing to give all yeah. the savings. No, no, without this thing. Just stand up and walk over here. Oh, I feel so bad for him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. okay. Come on, you can do it. You can see that he cares. He yeah, wants he to. to. He yeah. is trying so hard. Yeah. But that might be really hard for her to see. She's scared. Oh no! I don't. So, I'm so on the fence of how I feel. <laughs> For like both of us, like I feel bad for you, but I also feel bad for you. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. yeah. Being her over here is a bad idea. You have enough to deal with right now. You hear me? Do not bring her over here again. Okay. Okay. It feels like it's he's a shitty friend. If he wants to see his daughter, he should see his daughter. Yeah. It's not like she's alone. Nice to go. Ooh, he's choking. Oh, the puke was right. Choking. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Why can't these kids just drink oh, gosh, beer? You know? Turn the Are you choking? Around. Help him! Oh, God. Okay, lean on that arm. Lean on that arm. Okay, I need you to rock with me. Okay. God damn it, Charlie. What is wrong with you? What? Chew your food like a normal human being. You could have just died right in front of me. I'm sorry. Are you kidding me? I get you're scared, but no. I'm sorry, Liz. Every time he says he's sorry, it makes me want to cry. Yeah. Discussion for so... him this morning. In particular, a Bad post marriage. about crafting a good he thesis wasn't happy and he wasn't a quote. Himself Just pick a like, sentence from the reading you know, and say it's left, good or some shit. Found somebody Listen, he wanted to be with, at but this point in the course, so deal with I have given you all that I can that in terms of structure, sort of the, building you know, a thesis, paragraph organization. For that. 
But, but he doesn't get to see his daughter. All of that isn't built and on your own his, original the wife ideas is probably and truthful analysis. It horrible. doesn't mean anything. And then his that person that, that, that he blew up his life for dies. Think about the truth of your argument. By the church? Most likely. I know. This may sound and silly. And somehow the church is involved. But it's like, important. Oh, yeah. yeah. Most Promise. likely suicide by church. I was thinking of that, too. You know, I think you might like it if you actually read it. Mm-hmm. You're just like my teachers. Trying to teach you something? You think just because I'm not losing my shit over the poem, it's because I didn't read it. I did read it. It's overwritten and dumb and repetitive, and even though he thinks his metaphor of I is deep, it's actually just a bunch of bullshit. And in reality, he's just some worthless 19th century faggot. That's an interesting perspective. It would make for an interesting That is two slurs in this movie in the last ten minutes, guys. Just write that thing about exploding. So she's homophobic. My English teacher will love it. What? Yes. I don't know about the phobia part, but I think that she's got a sore spot there because of why her dad left. Right. It would be it would be internalized homophobia because of the reason that you're not gonna write these essays for me with Ellie. Yeah. I can And you're back. Why? Yeah. Are you his friend? Then why do I need a wheelchair? I was talking to one of the ER doctors. He said moderate activity would be a good idea. A sense of independence might help you out. And would you pay for this thing? Nothing. We ordered it for a patient a few months ago. It's just been sitting around. What happened to the patient? They died. Just try it out, please. <sighs> Back it up, back it up, back it up. Beep. Beep. <laughs> it's funny, not funny. It's funny. <laughs> I was the black sheep. I refused to go to church ever since I was 12. Dad knew I was a lost cause, but not my brother. He loved new life. He wrote me a letter a few months after he left, told me he was tired and lonely, but he didn't want to come home because he didn't want to get married. You didn't want to get married? Dad had set it all up. Pushed the boyfriend, getting married to this girl from the church he barely knew. I don't know. But when he came back, he met someone else. Fell in oh. love, started a whole new oh. life, and Dad kicked oh. him out of the church and the family. Yeah. One night, he doesn't come home. A couple weeks later, this guy is out jogging on a bike path near the river in Lewiston, sees something washed up on shore, and that was Alan. Mm. The love of Charlie's oh. life and my yeah. brother. Yeah. Oh. It's a The author was just trying to save us from his own sad story. I hate everyone. Wow. He's proud I hate everyone. Don't break my heart. <laughs> Keep getting like borderline yeah. welling up. Almost done. You know, I was in a really strange place in my life when I married your mom. Did I fucking ask? I just. Yeah. I'm sorry. I'm just trying to give you the answers. Yeah. yeah. Ellie. That's all she wanted. Look at me. It's not about the money. No. no. Who would want me to be a part of their life? No, that's a cop out. Yeah. Yeah. It is. Sorry, bud. That's a cop out. She would want you to be a part of her life, no matter what, because you're meant to be her dad. Mm -hmm. Hi. Uh, you... Come on. Is he? Is, is he okay? I don't know. I ground up some Ambien and I put <gasps> it in the sandwich. What? Let me give him a couple. He's fine. I can take like three at a time. Where did you get Ambien? I had sex with the pharmacist. I'm sorry, what? Wow. You drugged him? Gross. My mom pops on like Tic Tacs. I don't know if he should be taking Ambien. As she's no, like a pipe up. Does this make you nervous? Because it's just pot. It's not like I'm smoking meth or anything. I mean, anything. she has a I pipe though. I, I know what pot is, okay? No, you only <laughs> think you know what pot is. Take a hit. I don't want If you don't take a hit, I'm going to call the police and I'm going to tell them that you tried to rape me. Take a hit. What the, what the fuck? fuck? I don't understand you at all. Take another hit. 
What is going on? Look, I'm just fucking with you, all right? She is the I'm not gonna kill anyone. human body I'm not gonna tell anyone that you tried to me. It feels like she's just out to oh, hit others oh, because yeah. she is Maybe someone else finds she doesn't know Maybe how my to dad deal finds with it. I really I wish you know, it's so easy to make you uncomfortable, yeah. it's honestly. It's a little bit that they stopped doing door-to-door -door stuff last year. And some woman was out preaching or whatever, and a guy answered the door with no clothes on. What? What? I gotta go. Who were you really? Wait, what? He's not. Just tell me. What do you care? Because I think we have a blossoming I friendship. Bed. Oh, guys, I'm so confused. He's messing with you. too. What? No, I'm not. You're not gonna tell anyone? Who am I gonna tell? What? Get out of that fucking Please. bedroom. You were not. Yeah, I started to feel that way too. I don't feel that way. I know that you weren't helping people. It doesn't help people to tell them that they should believe in God. Why would that help people? True. I just said. Yeah. I see all That's my family, right. my friends. Absolutely. <laughs> they're all just so happy. Don't sit on the bed. Like Fuck off. Get off the bed. She I is I recording him. I thought so. For my own mission. Bitch. But why? You see, my faith saved what, just one person. Have like person. leverage over him or something? Yeah, that's what I was. Now I'm. Oh my God. Don't, don't touch it. it. Don't, don't touch, touch it. it. Do not touch shit. Oh, shit. oh God. Mom, don't freak out. Shut up, Mom's there. Mm. You again? Survive the war, survive. Charlie. Left some up a Over a hundred thousand at least, right? She seems very manipulative. That's not true, is it? Uh -huh. Yeah. No. Charlie. Last winter when my pickup broke down and I had to walk through the snow to get your groceries for you. I offered to get your truck fixed. Yeah, and I refused because I thought you had seven hundred dollars in your bank account. And why is for Ellie? It's always been for Ellie. If there was ever any kind of emergency, I would have given you the money. Would you? <laughs> Mom, you're not getting any of the money. Oh, shut up, Howie. I get why she's mad. Leave. Yeah, I do. Right now. She, she doesn't have a right. Can you try it? Oh. Wait. Doesn't. Get that through your yeah. fucking skull. Ellie, please. Just fucking die already. Enough! So, it's, it's a really good essay. <laughs> She's awful, isn't she? She's a terror, and you think it's my fault. Wait. Did you say that, Lou? Is that why you kept her from me all this time? Because you thought that I would think that you're a bad mother? I was worried she would hurt you. Hurt me? It's ridiculous. I don't take any pleasure in admitting it. She I'm did, a mother. she just drugs you. Right. This is crazy. I'm so into this movie. Me too. <laughs> like, yeah. I'm so conflicted. I too. You're wheezing. Yeah. It's like I feel bad for you, but I also feel bad for you, but then I feel bad for you worse. as well. And it's just uh -huh. like. I call someone? That was the last time I ever went swimming, actually. Oh, the sound of the water. The I kept cutting my legs on the rocks. And you were so mad that my legs bled and stained the seat of the minivan. <laughs> And you said for days after that, I smelled like seawater. It's just a lot of pain all the way around. Yeah. Yeah. No winners here. You sound awful. There's no direct quote-unquote villain either. No. Everybody is fucked up. Everybody yeah. did something wrong. Yeah. yeah. The entire situation should have been handled so much. Absolutely. I'm sorry. Yeah. Yeah. I'm all done. Fuck you. I need to make certain that she's going to be okay. We can't give up on her. You already gave up on her. You gave up on her when she was eight years old. I wish I could have been a part of her life, Mary. But there's 
got to part a point both of your where lives. Go to the you hospital. Can't keep dwelling on the past. You, yeah. can't you have money. That. Just go to the hospital. I need to know that she's gonna have a decent life where she cares about people and other people care about her and she's gonna be okay. I need to Mary, go. No, I have to go. Have anyone else? I need to know that I have done one thing right with my life! Oh my god. Oh fuck. We both played our parts. I raised her, and you're giving her the money. It's the best we could do. I hate that she walked out in that moment. He just wants to make sure his daughter is going to be okay. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Did she break it? I think so. You okay? This movie is going to yeah. very, very <clears throat> deep places. Yeah. The money is in the um. Sure. On every side. Like, it's if your daughter you sure you're doing who okay? had an absent father, you're gonna connect. Yeah. With and that's gonna Thanks, be Dad. Traumatic Have a good night. Okay. Mm -hmm. If you've been overweight and felt the way that he felt, you're gonna be triggered and all. Like, the mom, like, you worried about what happened. He blames her being a bad mom and that mom. Like, yeah. They go in. They go everywhere. With one uh, man. Oh, what the fuck? That's the delivery guy. <laughs> Now he's been dead. Everyone's like phenomenal with their acting so far. Yeah. Though. Absolutely not. Who doesn't want a fucking Oscar for this next game? Just like, in the stuff that we've seen. No way. We've still got a bit left of this movie, and I'm I'm blown away by his acting. Himself. Yeah. One last lesson from these ridiculous essays. Greetings. Just write. Write. Something. 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 The conversations about leaving his daughter, his ex married like that was all so triggering for him. And you can still want people to take take responsibility and do it. But you have to understand what's behind it too. Yeah. And you can be hard and have compassion all at the same time. Yeah. Your daughter, she took these pictures of me smoking pot and a, and a recording or something like that. And, she found my church in Waterloo somehow, and then she sent it to them, and they sent oh, it to no. my parents, and, and and you know what they said? Why? It's just money. And they forgive me, and they love me, and they want me to come home. But I finally understood why God brought me here to you. It's so I could help you understand what happened to Alan, so it doesn't happen to you too. Oh, God. Oh, you overstepped. How did you get this? Charlie, Alan tried to escape God's will. He chose his life with you over God. No! But this is why he was so obsessed with Fuck this you. verse. He knew that he was living in the flesh and not in the Sorry. spirit. He never prayed for salvation, but it's not Sorry. too late for you. No. Nope. Through the spirit, no. you can put to death the misdeeds of the body oh and you will No. Live. Get out. You think Alan died because he chose to be with me? Get out. You think God turned his back on him because he and I were in love? 
Get yes. the fuck out. Fuck oh, you. God. Terrible. You fucking piece of shit. Do you find but... that disgusting? Yep. Truly, God is ready to help you. Oh, I hope that there isn't a God. Because I hate to think that there's an afterlife and that Alan can see what I have done to myself. Carly. And he can see my swollen feet and the sores on my skin and the patches of mold in between the flaps. Stop. The infected ulcers on my ass and the sack of fat on my back that turned brown last year. Hey, stop. This is disgusting. Yes. I'm disgusting. Yes. You're disgusting. You're Fuck off. Leave. Right. Just leave. Get the fuck out of this You're fucking house. Do uh, not apologize. Only made it worse. Yep. What? I <laughs> hate that notion as someone who is very gay, but is also Christian. Right. Don't tell me my god don't love me, because my god loves everybody no matter what the fuck happens to them, mm -hmm. and no matter who they are. Exactly. And you've been so honest with me that I. I... He's gonna turn his camera on screen. Yeah. Is he gonna do it? Oh, I swear to fuck if they're not nice, I swear. I just wanna be I don't know. I can't do it all. Honest with you, too. <sighs> Why is compassion gone in this fucking world? Alright. Because human beings. These suck. assignments don't matter. Of course, it doesn't matter. Not all of them. College doesn't matter. I will say, not all humans suck. But These amazing, honest things that you wrote. I.e., they matter. Oh! I tried to save him, Liz. I thought that if I just loved him, that he wouldn't need anyone else. All I know is that you gave Alan the best years of his life. If it weren't for you, he would have jumped off that bridge years earlier. Nobody could have saved him. Believe me, I spent years trying. I didn't write it. This is the essay that you gave me yesterday. I didn't read it. I don't need to read it. Read it. It's her essay. I felt saddest of all when I read the boring chapters that were only descriptions of whales. Because oh, I knew. The thing that he's been reciting to himself is her. Oh, it's just her. trying to save us from his she own wrote... sad story. Oh. Just for a little while. <laughs> How do you have this? Your mother. Are you fucking with me like this? I'm not. I'm sorry for leaving you. I was in love. And I left you behind. You did not deserve that. I don't. I don't know how I could have done such a thing. You're so beautiful. You're amazing. Stop. You're amazing. This essay is amazing. If you read it, you asshole. You fat fucking asshole. You'll help me Fuck read you. It, please. Fuck you. Ellie. She can't go. Daddy, please. Yeah, he's missing a leg. Is he gonna go up to walk to her? Which is named Moby Dick. He's and which gonna is walk to her. In the course of the book, the pirate Ahab encounters many hardships. His entire life is set around trying to kill a certain whale. I think this is sad because this whale doesn't have any emotions and doesn't know how bad Ahab wants to kill him. He's just a poor, big animal. 
because I knew that the author was just trying to save us from his own sad story. Just for a little while. <laughs> this book made me think about my own life. And then it made me feel glad for my That was in my head when I w was watching this movie. I've uh, I've seen those of um, Brendan's uh, interviews f for doing the movie and stuff. And there was one interview I saw the other day, and he said that every single day he took the weight of obviously he had to wear special prosthetics and stuff like that. But he was, <laughs> he had that he took the weight of that home even though it came off he took that weight home every single day and he held it every single day and it helped him so much and that just stayed in my head the whole way through i don't know why it doesn't have any points but i really like the way they ended this movie yeah it's heartbreaking but beautiful at the same time to go to work after this. <laughs> <laughs> like, I gotta be to work in like 20 minutes. <laughs> You'll be crying oh. all day. Uh -uh. Y'all can kiss my ass. <laughs> <laughs> You're just I, gonna be a uh, sad mood. Lee, what did you think? <laughs> I. It met every single expectation. I mean, this I movie. First things first, this movie needs to come with a trigger warning. Yeah. I don't care you uh, are, yeah. how you feel about it. I know that that, you know, phrase is thrown around a lot these days. And, you know, and I'm one of those people that thinks it gets used too much. Um, but this should. There is not a character in this cast that you cannot relate to yeah. on some level. You yeah. can, and... Yeah. I've been the overweight person. I've been that person that has felt like they have to apologize for how they look. And it took until this year to say, no, I'm going to put myself first. And looking at your kids and not wanting to be that for your kids, it's heartbreaking. <laughs> But knowing that you can't stop what you're doing and the toll that it takes on you is just, people don't get it. They, all they see is why, why can't you do better? Why can't you be better? And so being able to connect in that way with him was incredible. Um, and then being that connecting with the mom and, you know, worried that people are going to look at you and think that you're a bad mom because your child is not what everybody expects them to be or is a little bit tough and not who you raised them to be and just worried that people are going to look at them and, and just blame you. So I was able to connect on that side as well. I wasn't really able to connect with the daughter because again, my parents been together. They're wonderful people. 
and I have a very close family, immediate family, and we talk every day. So on that side, I didn't get anything, but I get it for my son and what he's going to go through, knowing that his dad walked out and left for whatever reasons that may be. And then the sister, you know, of going through that again, it's just... Whew. And if he does not win for this performance, I will be in that boat. I am there. shocked to how that the movie itself isn't nominated for Best Picture. How this movie is not Mommy for Best Picture, I have no idea. Yeah. yeah. Well, it could be because of the messages behind it. No, that's why it should be. Most- yeah. That's why it should be. It's why it should be, but that they're not going to go for that. I mean, yeah, it's not a typical... They're not going to go for that. It's not like a typical storyline. Like, a lot evolved around LGBT stuff and all of that yeah. stuff as well. So, that's still... In a rural town where everyone knows everyone's uh-huh. business. Where the church runs that yeah. shit. Yeah. 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 Steph, what are your thoughts? I thought it was an incredible movie. Just heartbreaking. <laughs> I don't even know. No. Acting was know amazing. Yeah, no oh, yeah. I, d- I loved it. Did I thought it was incredible. DJ? Any final thoughts? I mean, it was fucking amazing and it put into perspective, though, for me, it was a different situation, but the amount of anger that you know, a child can mm-hmm. hold. Yeah. I felt that as well. I've been that angry. Yeah, me too. Mm-hmm. I've, I know that type of anger, and I know the implications that that causes, and I know the regret that it causes. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But I know what that mindset is like. And yeah. I haven't seen it in several years, but it just kind of brought that yeah. back. Just kind of hit me in the face yeah. that one did. Uh-huh. Yeah. <laughs> I wasn't yeah. expecting all this childhood trauma today. Uh-huh. Thank you, movie. <laughs> you can have an aspect of tough love and yeah. get up. Nobody can do this but you. You have to get up. You have to do something. You have to change. You have to. You can have that level. You can have that level of tough love, but you also have to balance that with the compassion and of actual love. a reason mm-hmm. behind it. Yeah. That's a, there's human being in yeah. pain behind that. This, yeah. this movie very it was heavily on mental health without explicitly saying it. If that makes sense, yeah. and, ev- and the mental health of every single character. And I think yeah. that they did a really, really good job. It was written beautifully. It was directed mm-hmm. beautifully. I yeah. can't think of one single thing wrong with this movie. What's your guys' ratings? Yeah. 20 out of 10. That's because it's what my behind went to write. Yeah, this is a 10 out of 10. Same for me, 10 out of 10. Mm-hmm. I think same for like, me. If you have not, and I'm sure that people that are watching this reaction have seen the movie, mm-hmm. but if you are one of those people that haven't, do yourself a favor and watch the entire movie. Yeah. It, but have a whole box of tissues ready. Yeah. 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 That ending it made part, me cry that at ending unex- part. It made me cry at such unexpected times. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It really did. And it didn't break me until the end. It, it got pretty damn oh, yeah. close. Oh, yeah. I broke way I, for that. We were doing... We were doing okay <laughs> until last, like, five minutes. When you found uh, out that it was yeah. You guys started crying at the last five minutes? I was crying, like, an hour ago. So, anyways, with that, guys. Be sure to like and subscribe, if you haven't, to Simple Reactions um, for his um, whole, uncut show reactions. You can go to the website, simplereactions.com. Also check out Patreon. Both of those will also have up to 20 week early show reactions. As there's just like a little bit of... Yeah, doing great. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, 20, re- 20 weeks early on Patreon and the website. Um, for information, check out you know you- YouTube itself, Twitter, Instagram. And come check us out at our mod Twitter if you want to chat. Yes, our mod squad. Come come chat with us. Yes. 
Almost all of us are on there. Yes. Yes. I'm DJ. <laughs> I'm Lee. I'm Steph. And I'm Claire. Thank Until you, guys. Time. Bye. Bye.